Pencils down. Pencils down. Mm. Ya no más. Ya no más. Aquí es el tiempo para Rambo. I want to see how long I can do it. Should I try to see how long I can? Right, like the, let's see like if the, you can do it the whole time. The whole show? The whole show. Rambo! I can't. Oh. I, I, I mean, I, could st I stopped early. I could still go. Uh -huh. You know what I just realized? What? I fucked up, dude. What'd you do? I, 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 I fucked up. Okay, how? Why? This past Ramble Radio was 305. Yeah. I have it listed as 304. There's two 304s. Oh, we can't have that. That can't. Who does? That, that can't. It's 305. What when are I we, babies? The, the YouTube, I put 305. See, you knew. Well, because I, 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 I check. There's I check. two 304s, Eddie. You can't have that. You need can't to, have you need it. You need to correct it. Well, that's going to get fixed. Good. Ready? You ready? You ready? As I'll ever be. Okay. Five, four, fixed, fixed. Look at that. Look how easy like we, that was. We just passed the threshold. Men, men, <laughs> men, men. I mean, fixed. Uh. And this is uh, ramble. Are you ready for this? What is it? Three thirty-nine. Three thirty-nine. Ramble radio was hot, hot, hot on, on our heels. Ooh. But I mean, I still think three thirty-nine is quite an accomplishment. Not bad. Not bad. I mean, we're still, you know, not bad. If you if you must, we're still deadlarked, as one would say. Well, we've we we haven't been consistent lately, so I can see why we've been. Dead why you, st what, you, you we've, still? You still? That's that's no excuse. These fucking people. Sorry, these fucking people should still be rating us five you're not, stars. You're not saying fuck the ramblers. I would never say okay. that. Okay, I would right. never say that. I'm just. I would because you're tiptoeing around the neighborhood of fuck the ramblers, <laughs> but you're not going into the neighborhood. These fucking people. <laughs> There's no excuse for them to still not, you know, give us five star ratings and positive, no. positive text reviews. Definitely not. There's yeah. still. Maybe it's because there's just so much emptiness behind me, Eddie. I'm just, I'm, I'm losing my mind. It's a maybe barren the, wasteland behind it's you. Used to be, used to be my playground, like oh. Madonna sang. So it's nothing worse than seeing an empty Billy. It's not because you knew something fun was in there. Something fun was in there. You know, billy. cool shit was in there because chicks oh. don't put anything in Billy's. No, they don't. They put candles and pictures yeah. and shit. Shit no one cares about. The books they don't read. Books they'll never read that their friend recommended yeah. because Men it's changing toys. your life. Men, real men. Action figures. DVDs. DVDs. Blu rays. Video games. Toys. Right. Stuff that the, makes people look when they walk in the house, they go and look at that shelf. I want to see what's happening over what's here. What's happening over there? Before I suck this guy's dick, let yeah, me I'm see. I'm gonna check out walk what's happening. <laughs> this guy has five Alice in Chain He's CDs. Wow, tickling his balls. Man, this guy along with this blow. This down. guy's got seven Alice in Chains didn't put out seven albums, but he's got seven. There's like a oh. bootleg in there. You hey, can put it in my ass. This guy is he's going anal. <laughs> no, but Andre is like if she has a billy, it's all bullshit. Like, oh, oh this yeah. is a book of a book of a print. It was a what? Of flowers. Oh, I don't know. Wow. She's the cats are being weird because they're fucking freaked out. Everything's packed up. All their shit's gone. All their shit's gone. You know, it's it's weird. They're having a rough go at things. Just seems like just yesterday, Andre and I moved you into that place. Seems like just yesterday. <laughs> Loli's great. Hey, Eddie had a great point. He seems like it was just yesterday that Andrea and I moved you into that place. Because <laughs> I threw my back out. Can I at least get my side of the story? I threw my back out, and so I was just eating Subway with Colton. <laughs> And I had a gig, so the following weekend I had a gig, so her and her mom had to move her shit in. I'll never forget, though, moving that fridge out of that brand-new painted apartment building. That we destroyed? <laughs> <laughs> we absolutely destroyed. They, they So we went to get a fridge on Craigslist, and Eddie, kind enough to drive over there with me to pick it up and put it in his truck so we could bring it over here. Oh. And the apartment building that that was housing the person 
selling it on Craigslist. They had just painted their hallways brand new. <laughs> <laughs> We fucking, we fucking three stooges the fuck out of that thing. <laughs> it, 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 so much that it was like, was this like some avant-garde paint job they did? Is this like some kind of artsy oh, farty? I mean, we went, in, we went into the drywall on some of the I shots. Mean, <laughs> it wasn't just cosmetic damage. We did physical damage to that hallway. And hey, thank goodness. <laughs> Ain't found us yet. Still free. Still free. Come and get us. That's what I'm saying. Uh, are you guys taking the fridge down? No. Or are you leaving it? We're getting a new fridge. They have a fridge already in the apartment. Look at that. And what are you going to bring? Two fridges? Do you want a fridge? We don't need. We've already got two fridges. You already have two. Yeah, see? That's we're, the thing. It, we're flush on fridges. You're you're an embarrassment of riches when yeah. it comes to fridges. What are you guys so, are you just leaving the fridge in the apartment? I'm gonna. We're going to see... If they'll right. allow that, we do. We take do you and I take it back. We should. I think we, we just take it back and just leave scratch it. Scratch the other side. Scratch. Well, fuck that's up the weird thing about is. California apartment living. Yeah. Most places you have to bring a fridge. Yes. That that's, was our. That was every place I. No, actually, no. I take that back. The little prison cells I used to live in, they provided the fridge because it was like a mini fridge. It's it all a mini fridge. It's a college beer. Fridge, college. But. Yeah, it's a beer fridge. So this. But every place I've moved in California, I've always had to have my own fridge. Always got to bring you over. This one has their own fridge. Central Air. Jesus Christ, we'll be Ooh, living like kings and queens my over there. Lord, that electric bill is going to be high. I know. I know. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Especially with your boy who likes it cold. We're going to see. Jesus Christ, let's six minutes. Do we sing the song? Sing the song. Give me a ticket for an airplane. Everybody. Ain't got time to take a fast train. Lonely days are gone. I'm a going home. My baby wrote me a letter. I don't care how much money I got to spend. Got to get back to my baby again. Lonely days are gone. I'm a going home. My baby, she wrote me a letter. Everyone. Well, she wrote me a letter. Said she couldn't live without me no more. Listen, Mr. Can't you see? I got to get back to my baby once more. Anyway, yeah. There we go. Nice. Bam. Bam. The, the wonderful box tops right there. So good. So good. Hit me a ticket for an airplane. Ain't got time to make a fast train. I mean, who? God, it's just so good. Mm. So good. Now, what was the name of the oldies that Pearl Jam covered? Last Kiss. Last Kiss. That's right. I was. I always get. I always get Last Kiss and the letter confused. Uh, I always used to. Last Kiss. Oh, where, where, oh, where can my baby, baby be? That's a rough one. Yeah. That's a, those are some hard lyrics. So definitely, I mean, well, yeah, it was that time in music history where there was like seventeen things about teenage death. Yes, yes. Was it leader of the pack? Is that still the most tragic? The leader I mean, of the I pack. Mean, last <laughs> kiss is pretty. <laughs> yeah, they're. I mean, they're all last rough. Last kiss is pretty tragic. Is but Lisa Gale's song about. Her baby who died, her kid who died. That's yeah. probably the yeah. worst that she filmed on the golf course cemetery. Probably, probably the boy. <laughs> <laughs> so Cody still can't be with us, but he he claims he's got a big day, big day today. Oof! Apparently, he, maybe, maybe he claimed he'll be back next week. All right, well, he, the plate should be a little cleaner next week. You would think. Well, God, who knows? What he, you know? Week. What I'm worried about is if mm -hmm. I just hope. Nothing happens to his girl, Magic the oh. Gathering. If you know what I mean, Magic the Gathering. You know what I, you you get it. Nothing happens to Magic the <laughs> Gathering. That's what I always. Those initials were always Magic the Magic Gathering. Magic the Gathering, and then she fucking co-opted <laughs> it. She ruined it, and, and she ruined, ruined it for it. everybody, among other things. I mean, she's ruined a lot more than that. Yeah. But that's something that is unforgivable in my book. Magic the Gathering. Empty, Magic the Gathering. So if something went down with him in Magic the Gathering, if Magic the Gathering gets in trouble, then I'm very worried for Cody. Because, <laughs> uh, see, I think he still thinks that she, like, loves him for him. That's Cody, though. Cody does that. He falls for these people. I know. I know. I mean, and, it was, it was Magic the Gathering, Lauren Boebert. It's just. We warned him. 
Yeah, what's her we face in Arizona? Him. Carrie Lake. He's Cody's. Just... <laughs> Just, they use him up and they toss him aside. He's like the guy who keeps throwing twenties at the Hooters girl for tips. He's one who thinks the stripper loves him. He does. It's just, it's man. It's too bad. Too bad. <laughs> oh, this is not going to be a long ramble. Okay, we're not reading any of your fucking emails. Wow. These fucking people. You guys, but not fuck the ramblers. Still not fuck. Never. The ramblers. What? Never. What? Never. Fuck the but Never. I'm not no. a monster. No, you're not. You're not. Well, look, we're not reading these fucking emails. These fucking people have had still no excuse. It's been to... a tumultuous uh, uh, past several weeks. Yeah. Not knowing what's happening. The big move. So once the big get, move. Once everything gets settled, you're we're back. We're not in, reading this shit. In the in the warm confines of Orange County. <laughs> right. Let's go, Brandon. <laughs> then. You got your big yard flag of let's go, Brandon. I'll right. You're feeling more at home. Giant let's go, Brandon. Yard we'll flag. get back into the regular swing of the ramble. Dude, are my neighbors going to be fucked, dude? I'm worried I'm going to die, not from cancer, but from a stray bullet. Because, <laughs> like, our downstairs neighbor just has, like, 40 AR-15s and accidentally <laughs> sets them off. <laughs> That's the fear. Yeah. But, so ramble three, th ramble 340. We're going to be doing next the list we would have done everything. for this one. We're doing a Does real that make ramble sense? next week. Yes. Real. Ramble at the ramblepod.com, Eddie. Okay. And we're going to read all the emails. Come on, y'all. From these fucking people. But from, right. The, the wonderful ramblers. <laughs> but, and Jay, but look. So that so basically, I'm just I'm going to switch it up a bit. Okay. Ramble 340 now. All right. We'll have Super Mario Power Up. All right. Ramble 340 yeah. will be what would Jethro Tull open, close, and encore with. And you're a big okay. Tull guy. Oh, you're huge, big. You're huge, big. <laughs> huge, huge Jethro Tull guy. Huge Tull guy. You're a Tully, if you will. What do you. <laughs> <laughs> the Tullster. I don't even have to do any research for this. It's just. <laughs> you could do it now off the top of your head. I can't. No I'm question. Gonna hold it next, I'm going to wait until next week. I'm not going to do it now. Right. Okay. I so in, I don't want to influence anybody else. Right. <laughs> well, it's because then this kind of cock blocks my idea, though. What? For Ramble 340. Okay. Or wait, this is 339, right? Yes. 339. For Ramble 340. Yeah. It's. Now, I'm being honest here. Okay. I kind of wanted to speculate okay. on what we think would be the. What do you think is going to win? So for Super Mario Power Up, what do you think would win? What do you think is going to be the like the most common? It's got to be the, the the flower plant, the fire plant, right? Fire flower, the fire flower. That's what I'm thinking. Either That's, that or the, the the mushroom that you the growing mushroom, whatever it's the, called, the, the regular mushroom, the Super yeah. Mario mushroom. Or the I would fire imagine flower. it's got to be either one of those. Because I mean, when, when you think power ups and Super Mario, those are the first two that pop in your. But head. dare I the say best. the raccoon suit changed the game? It did, but I'm, I'm not saying those it two are the changed best. the game. The leaf they gave you the tail changed the game. True, true. Changed, and then what about the star? You become the most You're, powerful creature in the universe. Um, in, in the world, anywhere, ever, for as long as that. that, 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 that I mean, I don't know. I, mean, I don't know. It's the greatest power up ever. But is it on the hat? But is it on the hat? Right. That's, is it on the hat? That's. It makes you absolutely invincible. And so I, was, I think I'm speculating. I think you're right. I think but fire was flower. there ever? Did you ever get a bigger thrill than when you hit a stone and the green mushroom popped out? That was the best thrill. And you got a. And yeah, you got I got a an extra up. fucking life. Like I mean, all the other. Y'all can say like, this too. There was no lower low. Yeah. Than when you hit the thing, the green one popped out, and you didn't catch it in time, oh, and it fell off dude, a chasm or something. You died twice. That exactly. You died twice. That there was no lower low. No. So, so I, that's what I'm saying. Like, is there a bigger thrill than getting the one up? Oh. As far as power ups Ooh, go, I it's man, Andrea. What do you think is the greatest Super Mario power up ever? Is it the Fire Flower? Is it the One Up? Is it the regular mushroom lets you grow? Is it the star? Is it the little leaf that gives you the tail lets you fly? The flying one. Wow! Wow! Andrea goes flying one. Yeah. 
Wow. wow. Sounds bad. Well, we know what Schmerelson's vote is. Somebody talks in his sleep. Jesus. <laughs> she made like a. She made no. I don't know. We're we're. It'll be for next next weeks. How she is just she made, handling moving away from Schmerelson? How are you handling moving away from Schmerelson? It's difficult, she said. <laughs> it's just got Schmerelson. It's got Schmerelson. <laughs> Vice president. Uh, oh man! He got that call recently. Pussy. He got a promotion. He got a promotion. He's moving up. He is moving. Up. I I'm you okay? Next election season, Eddie, you've got to save all the Schmerelson smear oh. smear campaign smear the Schmerelson smear campaign. Schmerelson smear. When they smear Schmerelson. <laughs> when Schmerelson gets smears smeared, you have to. <laughs> <laughs> When 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 he gets smeared, you have to save those, the that smear campaign against the guy. I got What did he do? Is... What did he do? Here's the recent one. I think I sent it to you guys. Oh, I'll you play did. For the yeah. Ramblers. Yeah. I'll, I'll play it for the Ramblers. Evening, gorgeous three families. This is Scott Schmerelson, your representative on the Board of Education, and this year I have been elected as the board's vice president. Whoa. Oh. We are celebrating Women's History Month. Wow. The 2023 theme is Women Who Tell Stories. Therefore, today, I am honoring Dolores Huerta, who I had the privilege of meeting last Saturday at the Women in Leadership Summit. <laughs> Time out. Time out. Can I one up him? Please. Do you know who Dolores Huerta is? No. Have you ever heard the phrase, si se puede? That was her. Oh, she she know. was standing next to Robert Kennedy when he was murdered. Oh, oh, that's right, that's right. That's she right. is a yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. He want. I did a what? comedy show for her. What? She came up after me and said I was fucking funny. Oh, that's she is dear friends with my dear friend Christella Alonzo. Ah. So I don't like this guy name dropping Dolores like that. She's she and with a full accent too. Right. She deserves way better. He didn't She's say a, it in Schmerelson tone. No, she she deserves way better, Dolores, than to get used. I'm gonna say it, used by him to mm. prop his own bullshit up. Is women in history women who write. Women who tell this stories. Is Scott Schmerelson. Schmerelson. This is women who tell stories. Dude, she was standing next to RFK when he got murdered. Oh. And now, you know what I mean? I guarantee you she shook his fucking hand and was like, okay, and then was gone. I'm Scott I'm Scott Schmerelson. You know, I was once the vice principal at Johnny Cochran. Okay, okay, bye-bye. <laughs> you, you must be Dolores Huerta. Huerta. I guarantee you that was a two-second photo op. Scott Schmerelson. No, he, I, don't like, I don't like him. I don't like him doing that. I don't like him it's doing that. Now did he's he moving do, into a... Uh, Dolores, did, did, did he do a show for her? I just want to know. No, exactly. Did he did do not. a set? Did he get his picture? No. Did he get his fucking picture? Hold on. Did he you get his fucking picture with Dolores? Yes. Did he? Did he have one? He got her panties. He doesn't need a picture. Exactly. That's a problem. Got- they all, the ladies all melt for Schmerels. <laughs> they all melt for the sh- for the Schmerels. Doesn't matter. It's just they all melt for Schmerel. Scott Schmerelson. <laughs> oh, this is Scott Schmerelson. Do you think, I mean, I'm not going to ask Andrea, but do you think he's packing? He's packing. Shut uh, up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> wow. Did you what? hear that? What? Give me that again. What is the this? problem is he's got a really long dick, but his balls are longer. <laughs> Way longer. Way longer. Oh. Wow. Ugh. Don't don't adjust anything. That scraping sound you hear is just the just big boy coming at you. <laughs> big Scott like Schmerelson. Looks like I got a ball stuck in there. Looks like I got a big old no, nad. I got a giant gonad here because I'm Scott Schmerelson with my nads. Look at that shit. Right there. The Lotus one. Right there, Look baby. Look at that. Look at that shit. Look at that. Let's see fucking. He ain't got. He ain't, he ain't topping that shit. No. Fuck well, that. He- he tapped that shit is what he did. I don't think he I hope not. I, I think no. he did. I think I think, I think great. Two pictures. More than one. Wow. Two. Wow. Fuck out of here. Wow. Fuck out of here with that shit. That motherfucker. Did she laugh at that joke when you, you said you beat off in your girlfriend's eye? Is that what she is that, is that her favorite bit? She yelled encore. 
There, look at that. Cristela, <laughs> myself, and her. Where's Schmelson? Look. Where's he? Look at that. He's waiting at home. Fuck, he ain't got the shit. whipped cream and strawberries. <laughs> I put strawberries on my nipples. <laughs> I think she got Schmerelson. Oh God, <laughs> you imagine? I don't know why I get that guy has the door. There's no way he's got a smooth pickup line. There's no way he'd, he. He just says I, who he is. That's all he needs. I'm Scott Schmerelson. I'm Scott Schmerelson. Give he, me some of your brown he, sugar. <laughs> and it flashes, somehow works. He flashes a few hundred dollar bills in their face. Right. Like, oh, this guy. Roll, this guy's a roll. He's got his chain. <laughs> it's dollar sign chain. On. <laughs> I'm Scotch Merrillson. Give me your so give me some of your brown sugar. And it works. Andre if, thought it was a real photo. If you and I's right, if you <laughs> like he's walking around with hundreds and a dollar sign chain. <laughs> and someone snapped a photo. And a Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> Like anybody <laughs> not on Halloween would be to dress like that. And even on Halloween, like who the fuck are you supposed to be? This is stupid. I don't get it. I don't get the costume. <laughs> it's I don't, not a costume. I'm just got me. I'm just got Schmelson lighting a cigar with my flaming hunt with twelve grand and hundred dollar bills that I've set on fire to light oh. my cigar with. In my Hawaiian shirt. In my Hawaiian shirt with my bling money <laughs> sign. <laughs> Fuck! Ugh. Why didn't he do that? If I were him, I would have owned it. When oh. I saw that ad, I would have showed up to every meeting dressed every, like that. Every debate, every everything. everything. <laughs> with the Just pistols of hundreds and... Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Andrea! Come here real quick. I have to remind her. <laughs> Babe! The fuck over here! Come on! You got to charge that hoe. Did you find the charging cord? Well, yeah, we're That's on you, fool. Your problem. Hey, so we're just laughing. It's, a, it's your annual reminder that you still thought that Schmerelson picture was real. Where he had... Wait, these are saved very... Yeah, you thought that was... You thought he just walked around. I thought maybe it was like a party. You thought he just I like... He <laughs> Eddie! 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 <laughs> I thought they took a picture of him at a party. Uh, like a Pepsi Lowe's party. Oh. At a party. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How did you think that was real? They did your boy dirty. They oh. did your look at that. They did look at what? Man, I don't even look at the inside. Hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on. He's apparently uh, in the pocket of McDonald's. Big Mac. And pocket of Big McDonald's. And BP. Look at that. He's bought and sold by BP. He's smoking Stokies opioids too. He's on the bottle of opioids. His face is on all the little cigarettes. And then his face on all the little cigarettes. <laughs> He's opioids. dirty. Holy shit. Uh, so do we read this? We, uh, we should have known this. In order to supersize his investment funds, Smarrelson purchased thousands of dollars of McDonald's stock. Despite the fact that 45% of Los Angeles children are overweight or obese by the fifth grade, Schmerelson was the only board member to vote against a resolution to end fundraisers catered by McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> no fucking way. We're keeping McDonald's. Nope. Protecting our children. I love a good frosty. I love it. <laughs> Protecting our children's What's future. What's your fundraiser without frosty bars? <laughs> protecting our children's future means protecting them from environmental disasters. Not to Scott Schmerelson. He's invested over $10,000 in BP, the company responsible for the Deepwater Horizon oil spill, which the New York Times called one of the worst environmental disasters in the United States <laughs> history. Schmerelson even invested thousands, uh oh, uh, what? in Johnson and Johnson. Ooh. So he's a New York jet guy. He's uh, a jet guy who had uh, supplied 60% of the opiate ingredients used by drug companies to make pres prescription opioids. Scott Schmerelson is profiting. 
Well, he's nearly twenty pra- percent. He's, pra- he's practically forcing opioids into the mouths of America and our children. And our children, practically. In order to maximize the return, and okay, whoa! When Scott Smerelson joined the school board, he became a notorious double dipper, Ooh. taking a generous salary and a fat pension. In go. order to maximize his return on investment, he tripled his own pay. <laughs> that's how you afford that bling. <laughs> that's not cheap. He wore. Andre thought this was right. He's <laughs> just walking around with his togi and money, <laughs> and a and a and a, a money sign necklace. Is I uh, yeah, just uh, headed over to uh, Home Depot to get some shit. Just to dress, make a couple errands. Just you know, pick just up run some a bread couple and some errands milk. to get this thing. <laughs> oh. oh my god! Oh man, Scotty! Oh. He'll. I mean, I that's going to be the hardest part. I would imagine is saying leaving, to, saying goodbye to to this to, to the Schmierlson. to the Scotch to the Schmier campaigns <laughs> against him, uh, the 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 Schmierlson Schmiers. Oh, oh. <laughs> wow! Wait, what? What? I don't understand what? this this statement. This is on his ethical violations. You okay. ready? Okay. Can you please make now? This I don't want to be. Uh-oh, Smarrelson invested in Juul Tobacco, which markets candy-flavored tobacco products to hook children on nicotine. Not good. Um, ethical violations. I, I don't know where you make the connection here, but Eddie, you ready? Yeah. While Donald Trump is hosting government events at his own properties and using taxpayer dollars to pay for trips to his Mar-a-Lago property, Scott Smarrelson was investigated by the California Fair Political Practices Commission for violating the law by misreporting his investments in Jewel and McDonald's. Smerelson is putting his own economic interests above the health and safety of LAUS. What does that have to do with Trump? I don't know, but... <laughs> they just think if you put Trump in the same paragraph... There's reaching. They're trying to equate him to him. And I don't know. Maybe you can. <sighs> Scott Smerelson. Scott Smerelson here. <laughs> Scott Smerelson. So you think it's going to be... the? I, I'm kind of with you. I think the Fire Flowers should win. Back to our original but point. But again, circling back, I don't think you got a bigger charge than when you got that one-up one green up, mushroom. The extra life. Because especially in that game, it was that was that was the one that, that like, was oh, I got, oh, I got an extra shit, life. I can keep going. I can keep going. Because you can't continue in Mario, Super All Mario right, Brothers. All right, Jethro Tull. Uh, let me see. What do you think is going to win? Let me get my Let me get my Jeff. Uh, let's go. Too old th- for rock, too old to rock and roll. You think so? I think I, what's so. the one that? Or bungle in the jungle. Bungle in the jungle. Probably bungle it's, in the jungle. You, th- you think that's going to pop up on most I w- people's I list? I would think bungle in the jungle. I think for me, it's either going to be aqua lung or locomotive breath is going to show up the most. Okay. You know, locomotive breath yeah. sitting in the park. That's no, that's pro- aqua lung. That's Aqualung. I and girls with bad intents. Probably Aqualung. But locomotive breath is boom, 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 boom. In the shuffling madness of the locomotive breath. And of course, that's also the famous Ron Burgundy solo that he plays at yeah. the party is from locomotive. I, so I, it's all right. I don't know. We shall see. We shall it's see. It's going to be tough. We shall see. But we don't want to give away too much because then no, we people will cheat off ours. We do. That's right. They'll we don't cheat want that off to our list, and we're not trying to do that. We're, that's that's not who we are. No, ma'am. Is that who we've ever been? Nope. Thank you. It's not so. the uh, code of the ramble. No. And as much as people try to break it, not on, not not us. Not on this watch. Not it's not going to happen here. Not fucking ever. Now the bad news is because of the moving. Yeah. And because of all this Mueller, we will not have a Ramble Radio on Friday. No. And we'll, also we'll be actively moving. Yes, and it's catching up. We gotta we gotta we gotta hold Ramble Radio down a bit. Don't you think? We are gotta we gonna do we, that? Are we gonna are we gonna We gotta put we maybe we might intentionally drop put the, the numbers thumb a little on bit. The, uh, mm. I mean hmm. I don't see how we don't now. All right. I think we need to give Ramble a few more weeks on having the bigger number. Oh. <laughs> I, don't th- I mean, 
Well, because we, we all we, know it's going to overtake it. We talked about if it does overtake it, we just combine it into one giant ramble. Right. We might have to. I'm then, very nervous about that. And the next thing you know, we've got nearly uh, 800 rambles. 8,000. 8,000 rambles. 8,000. Can you imagine? Rambles. But we, but so anyway, no ramble. But you have extra ramble at the ramble at the ramblepod dot com. Super the Mario Power Up, time. the biggest. What would Jethro Tull open, close, and encore for Ramble Two Forty? Top five, Ant Man and the Wasp in Quantum Mania moments. Yes, you be the judge. All right, so we're gonna leave you on that. I want you all to have a wonderful evening. You know where to find us. Have a great rest of your week. Do that. We'll be back maybe with Cody. Mm, we'll see how uh, we'll Magic s- the Gathering does. We're going to see how Magic the Gathering. We're going to see how this all plays out. <laughs> but we'll see. But, yeah, so we're going to figure this out. We'll be back, though, next week. Get those emails in. You even have Hopefully, more time now. We'll get back into a normal, regular cycle of the, the same high-quality content. That rambles, you expect. That you deserve. You deserve. That, frankly, you deserve. All you wonderful ramblers right. and James deserve. And maybe, maybe we'll find out who won the battle of the butlers at some point. Could you imagine if all that happened next week? Could you imagine? I mean, I can't. I can't even imagine. Oh, my God. Well, you have a great rest of your week. We love you all. Stay safe. Take care. We'll see you next time, everybody. Bye. Bye. I'm Scott Schmidt.